Hey, Leo. So, the messages I was getting for you guys was confusion. So, you definitely could be confused about a certain, you know, decision that you need to make right now or just in general. Also, I do feel like there's somebody guiding you or someone... I don't know, I feel like there's definitely someone around you that maybe you just met or you're not even aware is guiding you, is guiding you. So, maybe like this is a new friend that came into your life or maybe someone that you look up to or this could be vice versa. Maybe you're guiding someone. So, we do have the Knight of Wands here. I'm definitely feeling like some of you guys could be traveling or even considering moving, um, like houses, relocating. We do have the Justice card here. So, I'm feeling like right now things are... Whatever you're confused about is going to become clear to you. A lot of you guys can be dealing with the Libra, but I do feel that like karma is happening for you right now or karma is being served right now. So whether you're on the good side or bad side of that, I do feel like when things are happening for you, we have the Eight of Cups. So there definitely can be um, something that you're walking away from. Some of you guys can be walking away from a Libra or a fire sign. Here's Leo Sagittarius. So, yeah. Yeah, we have the Emperor card here. I do feel like you're taking control of something or the something that you are taking on. So maybe you're taking on um, another responsibility, another job, school, mostly getting a child. Maybe some of you guys are having a child soon. But I do feel like there's going to think, I don't know, things are, I don't feel like they're going to get like bad for you or anything or like stressful but i do feel like you are taking on a lot more responsibility we have the five of swords here so for some reason i'm feeling a very energetic feeling with the five of swords like the universe has some sort of hidden plan for you or if you are going through something that maybe seems a little bit stressful or you're just like really not sure what is going on or where you're going with this relationship with this job or whatever situation i do feel like things are going to become clear and there is some sort of plan for you we do have the Queen of Pentacles here, so a lot of you guys could be focused on money and stability at this time. I'm also getting that a lot of you could be healing from some sort of situation if you have walked away um, from someone or something, like a job, a friendship, whatever. Temperance card, some of you guys can be dealing with the Sagittarius. I'm also getting Aries here. What is the energy surrounding Leo? But I definitely feel that you guys are taking control of something. And it could just be your emotions or just, like, your own energy. We have the Two of Pentacles here. So this is a card of balance. Also, a decision. So this could be what you're confused about on what to do, how to handle a situation. But whatever this decision is, I definitely feel like it's up to you. So if this is something um, between you and somebody else, I feel like it's up to you to, like, take some sort of action on whatever this is. So... We do have the Five of Cups here. This is regret. So somebody could feel regret about something. I do feel like it could be something that someone said. Maybe they regret something that they've said to you, or you could regret something that you've said to someone else. So clarify the Knight of Wands. I'm also getting some of you guys could have regretted um, making a move, like moving houses, moving states, something like that. Or this could be someone around you. Yeah. We have the Five of Swords here. So, all right. So I feel like if some of you guys are considering moving, I don't feel like things are necessarily going to go bad. However, I do not feel that they are going to go as you plan them to. Okay. Clarify justice. What is a justice card here? For some reason, I feel like your life is going to take a turn. Like whether it's for the better or for the worse. I feel like it's going to be for the better. I don't really feel negative energy here, but I do think something is going to surprise you. And maybe you get an offer of some sort or a job offer of some sort. Like maybe you're about to move and then like, boom, you get an offer for like a super good paying job right where you're at or something like that. I do feel like some in somewhere your plans are going to switch. So we do have the four of wands here. A lot of stability coming your way. Also, some of you guys could be in a very stable relationship or you could be leaving a very stable relationship or what you thought was stable with the eight of cups here. A lot of you guys could be... Um, Deciding to be single with the Nine of Cups. Um, this also could be a divorce. Four of Wands could represent marriage. Clarify the Eight of Cups. Why is the Eight of Cups here? Okay. Ooh, yeah. We have the Five of Wands. There could be a fight. Like, maybe you and somebody else get in a fight. Or some sort of argument to where you're just like, okay. I'ma just head out i guess shit i really feel like somebody's gonna walk away from whatever this is so i am noticing you have a lot of fives here 
definitely can be saying 555 a lot. But damn, yeah, a lot. Some of you guys are gonna literally walk away from something. We have the Eight of Cups here again with the Hermit card. I do feel like some of you guys just need time to yourself, time to think, time to figure out what is best for you. So, but fives mean change. So there definitely is going to be something that changes in your life that maybe you are not expecting. So, clarify the Five of Swords. Why is the Five of Swords here for Leo? Okay. Okay, so we have the page. Ooh, we have the page of swords here with the seven of swords. Somebody is definitely keeping up with you, can be watching you, is very interested in what you're doing. Also, the page of swords can be some sort of not so good news. I do feel like you could be finding out news about maybe someone is lying to you with the seven of swords here, or somebody, uh, somebody could be doing something behind your back, whether it's a friend, a relationship, a family member, whoever. Clarify the seven of swords. Okay. Yeah, the Knight of Swords, I do feel like somebody could have lied about you or lied to you. Some Something about communication. Somebody lied. Could be an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Queen of Pentacles here. This could be why you could have found out about this. This could be why you're walking away from some sort of friendship or relationship. Could have had the Queen of Pentacles. Okay, so we have the King of Pentacles. Yeah, this definitely could be someone that you're in a relationship with that maybe things are a bit rocky right now. Okay. Yeah, I do feel like somebody could regret lying to you. I think that's what could be the, what this regret is. Or regret keeping something from you. Clarify Temperance. Why is the Temperance card here? I do feel like whatever information or clarity that you got it is going to allow you to heal from a situation. So... I do feel like you could be rethinking a decision for the Two of Wands here. So, clarify the Two of Pentacles. A lot of twos here as well. Okay, we're seeing twos around the world. Shit. Yeah, you're you're not satisfied with some something. Like what this is a friend or relationship, whoever you are not satisfied in this. So I do feel like you're debating on what you want to do. A lot of you guys could have moved and are not satisfied where you moved. A lot of you guys could have moved in with someone, like a partner. We have the queen and uh, the queen and king of pentacles here. Like maybe you moved in with your partner and you're like, mm, I'm not feeling this. Like maybe you don't have enough space or something, or maybe you guys fight a lot. But I do feel like you're going to take some sort of action on this. Okay. Clarify the five of cups. Why is the five of cups here for Leo? Hey, ooh, yeah, the Ace of Swords. Somebody regrets something that they said to you. It could be a Gemini or a Virgo. We do have the Magician here. Somebody definitely regrets something that they said to you. Like, I do feel like whatever they said could have caused you to walk away. Like, like, be like all right, I'm done. And then they regret it now because you walked away. Let's see. Universe, what is the advice for Leo? Let that card just go. There we go. All right. So you have the Six of Cups here. I'm definitely feeling like reflecting back on the past. or I do feel like whatever this lie is, I feel like you could have already known what this was. Like before you found out about it. So definitely reflecting back on maybe some feelings that you had on the past about this whole situation. But I feel like reflecting back on the past is definitely um, something to consider right now. Or like maybe something from the past is going to make sense now that you have this clarity. Or now that this person like, it feels like a very heated conversation. This person could have blurted someone out something out and you could be like oh i do it like something like that okay yeah so we have the four of cups i'm definitely feel like there is something that the just this person just doesn't look happy either of them so i do feel like if there is something that you're not satisfied about um taking whatever action that you need to take to change that we do have the king of wands here and the high priestess just sewed itself to me so pretty much using your intuition on what you should do about the situation i feel like I've definitely feeling like take your emotions and take your thoughts out of it. Uh, what would be the best thing to do financially or whatever. Definitely use your intuition on what the right thing to do is about this decision. Anyway, Leo, I hope this was a good reading for you. If you'd like a personal reading, there's information down below on how you could get one. And enjoy the rest of your week.